David, I talked to food truck owners who have been in business for two to three years and have seen other trucks come and go, but not as many as there are today. They say food trucks are slowly becoming more popular and that running one is not as easy as it seems. We wanted to not get stuck into a three or four year you know, contract in a brick and mortar. Neil Gom was introducing a new product, British Pasties, and didn't want to be limited. A food truck's great that you can move it somewhere else and try the concept in a different part of town as well. London Calling opened about three years ago, sharing this parking lot with other trucks. It's a family business. After culinary school and fine dining restaurant experience, Mark Yant thought it was time to start his own thing. Uh, we opened uh, the paddy wagon in August of 2015. A food truck is a business model people are curious about. Once a week, at least, somebody asking me questions about, I want to start a food truck. And it's gaining popularity. You can get a loan for the truck or a lease on that truck maybe a lot easier than you could get a line of credit for a business. And now you have wheels you can get from place to place. And you've got a billboard, a massive way to market your business all in one cool package. But don't be fooled, these owners say, because challenges still exist. The hours are pretty much the same. We work silly hours, waste management and everything is you're outside in the elements a lot of the time so you've got to empty water, fill water. It's just a different type of a restaurant, you know, one that moves around and uh, has to be bolted down every day when you leave. So. Same park, different menus. About three or four different kinds of smothered fries. Just these trucks are friendly neighbors trying to grow the food truck movement in Springfield. The more businesses that are functioning and profitable and making some cash, the better for all of us in Springfield. When it comes to location, the food trucks can park and sell on private property with permission or at sites designated by the city. Yant tells me there are many restrictions for the trucks, how long they can stay and how close they can park, and that he'd like to see the city consider a food truck park in the future.